In this video, I go over 10 fun facts that you may not have known about Toronto. Hey guys, my name is Morgan Little. I'm a realtor here in the city of Toronto, so it's my job to know a lot about it, and it's my pleasure to share with you these 10 fun facts that you probably didn't know about Toronto. Watch till the end, and if there's anything you think should be added to the list, let me know in the comments. Let's go. Starting with number one. You probably could have guessed that Toronto is Canada's largest city, but did you know that it's the fourth largest city in North America after Mexico City, New York, and LA? Toronto proper has about 3 million people with almost 6.5 million across the greater Toronto area. Number two, contrary to popular belief that Toronto is a concrete jungle, the city is actually over 25% forest covered with over 10 million trees. That's a lot of trees if you ask me. Number three, downtown Toronto may be known for its condos, but did you know that it's also home to North America's only castle, Casa Loma, which hosts tons of events so you can check it out for yourself. Number four, everyone knows the CN Tower is tall, but it's actually the largest freestanding structure in the Western Hemisphere. Finished on April 2nd, 1975, it was the tallest building in the world until Dubai's Burj Khalifa surpassed it in 2009. Moving on to number five. The Toronto Zoo is the largest zoo in Canada and one of the largest in the world. Located in Scarborough, the Toronto Zoo is home to over 5,000 different species and spans an astonishing 710 acres. I've actually never been myself, but I know I've been wanting to take my daughter, so that'll change soon. Maybe I'll see about doing a video at the zoo. Number six, Young Street is one of the longest streets in the world. Downtown Toronto's Young and Dundas Square is an iconic attraction, but many people don't realize that Young Street is in the Guinness World Book of Records as the longest street with its nearly 2,000 kilometers. That is 1,242.742 miles to my American friends. Number seven, Toronto is known as the most multicultural city in the world as it is home to citizens from over 200 distinct ethnic groups with 50% of Torontonians being born elsewhere. Are you thinking of moving to Toronto? If so, I'm always happy to have a chat and answer any questions you might have. Feel free to book a call using the Calendly link in the description below and I look forward to talking. Moving on, the Sky Dome, <clears throat> I mean the Rogers Centre, was the first ever stadium to have a fully retractable motorized roof. It can host around 50,000 people to watch the Blue Jays play or any number of concerts that come through the city. The Path is the largest underground shopping complex in the world. A collection of tunnels and walkways that connect some 70 buildings in downtown Toronto, the Path hosts over 1,200 retail stores across 30 kilometers of underground space. Number 10, the Toronto Islands are the largest urban car-free community in North America. For a lot of people, Toronto Islands are a fun place to visit in the summer for as many beaches, including a nude one, but there are also residents who call the place home and it being an island, you gotta get there by boat so you won't see any cars driving around. And those are my 10 fun facts about Toronto. Which one was the biggest surprise to you? Let me know in the comments and we'll keep the conversation going. And again, if you wanna have a chat about moving to Toronto, use that link in the description below and I look forward to connecting. Let's go.